Pre-chopping the nucleus of soft cataracts. In this video, we are going to see four cases. This is the first stone of direct and hydrodissection. The anterior chamber is filled up with 2% HPMC. Now, a sustainer is taken in the left hand and the pre-chopper in the right hand. This is Dr. Sohil's pre-chopper. Dr. Sak Sohil is from Nandit, Maharashtra. Uh, here it is. This is real time and within few seconds the nucleus has been divided into two halves. Visco is again injected and see how easily the nucleus can be managed. The sustainer is being used for dividing the nucleus into smaller pieces. Now we come to the other hemineucleus and emulsify and remove the nucleus. The epinucleus is managed easily. This is the second case. Nucleus sclerosis is about grade 2. Rexis and hydrodissection, hydrodelineation is done after visco filling the anterior chamber with visco here goes the sustainer and this is the pre-chopper both the instruments are brought at the center and within few seconds the nucleus is divided into two heminuclei this is real time see how easily the nuclear pieces the heminuclei can be managed. So once the nucleus is divided into two halves, it is very easy and it saves a lot of time. So a pitch upper helps a lot. And now let us see the third case. Again the nucleus sclerosis is about grade 2. After rexis and hydrodissection, the interchamber is filled up with visco. And now the sustainer goes in and the pre chopper also goes in. The sustainer hooks the equator of the lens mass and the pre chopper progresses towards the sustainer and the nucleus is divided into two halves in few seconds. This is real time and just imagine how much time is saved. If we want to do stop and chop, it's definitely going to take much more time. Any instrument that saves time is worth trying. And this is the hemineucleus. It can be easily tumbled or it can be easily emulsified. The pebble of the fecal needle is placed in such a way that the fallibility increases. In this case I tried to manage the the nucleus in this way. It may look dangerous but I am, have reduced the vacuum and it is not so. And now let us observe the fourth and the last case of this video. Again the nucleus sclerosis is about grade 2. Rexis has been done. This is hydro dissection. The fluid wave goes to the other side, hydrodelineation is attempted and here it is. This is a mark so that I can go along that path to divide the nucleus into two heminuclei. And here it is. Both the instruments come to each other and within few seconds 
the nucleus is divided into two hemi-nuclei. I have tried Dr. Akahoshi's pre chopper but it was not so easy. This instrument appears quite user-friendly and the learning curve is not going to be steep. It is quite safe. The length of the pre chopper is about 2 mm but the thickness of the lens you know is about 4 to 4.5 millimeter so there is no way that the pre chopper will cause some damage to the posterior capsule and here it is the nucleus is nicely managed thank you very much for your attention hope this video will help you in developing your surgical skills it will increase you to use pre chopper particularly in soft cataracts where you cannot hold the nucleus with vacuum